and welcome back to Colville Farms. Uh, in my introduction to hydroponic video, I said I was going to be transplanting a strawberry uh, plant into a mason jar, and I'm going to introduce that to hydroponics. Everyone say hi to Austin. Hi. Once again, my kids are my world. So very first thing I'm going to do, well, first let me explain what this is. This is just a mason jar, uh, actually from my wedding. I got married last year, and we still yes. have some of these left over. So, I don't know if you can really see it, but it's kind of dirty. So, what we're going to do is just really clean that out. I'm helping. Yep, and she wants to help. She's my little helper. We're just going to give this a good old rinse. Austin, can you please give me the black towel right over there? Thank you, bugger. Okay, so now we're just going to dry this off. I don't I really know. know. I would be in that. I don't really know how this is going to turn out since there's sparkly sprinkles everywhere. But you know what? That's what gardening's all about, guys. You're not Sparkle. always... No, Austin. You don't always know exactly uh, the hundred percent on everything that's going to come out, so we're just going to wing it. Uh, I don't always like to plan; sometimes it's just better to do. So, what? How this is going to work is this is going to be filled up with water all the way up until the base of this net cup right here, and the plant's just going to sit right in there like that. I'm currently, let me show you, I have this huge whole entire tray. Not a lot of strawberries made it, guys, except for this guy right here. He's a couple months old, and he's just really... Austin. She's a little hyper today. So what we're going to do is we're just going to fill this up with water right now, and we're going to go from there. I'm going to show you guys how to transplant safely. And the key is, is we just want the very bottom of the net cup in the water. So, just like that. A perfect clean. Here you go, my helper. Get this wet, please. To put my you gotta make your hair all pretty. Yeah. yeah. She likes to be very beautiful because she is beautiful. So, nope. Not like that, you goofy goober yeah. brain. We get to halfway up. So. We gotta. Actually, we really don't gotta get this all wet, I guess. So, we're just gonna rip this in half. Not quite all the way through. See how I open this up? Yeah. All right, you see it, Austin? Mm -hmm. And now we're gonna get out our strawberry plant from the dirt. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Why do you have to do that? Because we're gonna take this plant from a hydroponic system into a... And then you're gonna... Good thing I got half of it wet. Yeah. You are my big helper. Justin doesn't help all the time. She's being a tattletale right now. You are not. I'm telling the truth. So now what we're going to do is we're going to very safely and carefully put these strawberry plants right inside of the rock well. Remember the rock well is what sits is, is this part right here. It's actually called rock, rock wool. Sorry. I found this. Okay, awesome. Thank you. So now we're going to very carefully put this right in here. And now let me just show you what this is going to sit in here like. Just like that. And what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to put some pebbles in there so that way fungus doesn't grow. And then once again, we have to put in our rapid start. And remember guys, like I said in the other video, this is some potent stuff. I do not have my dripper with me, so I'm just going to literally do 
a drop, two drops. And now I'm going to put this right back in here like that. I'm going to have to readjust this strawberry. Oh, I don't know if I did mention this is a strawberry plant. We're gardeners anyways. We love to garden. Yep, we love to garden. All right, and just like that, now we have safely put a strawberry plant in there. Austin, do you remember what this is called? Uh-uh. Uh-uh? What kind of farm did we make? Hydroponics. Hydroponics. Yay to hydroponics. Just like that, let me show you a front facial camera. Just like that. So what we did once again is we took the mason jar, we cleaned it all the way out, and we filled up the water just to the base of the netting cup. We then added this rapid start. It's a 1 to 0 0.5 to 1 ratio. It yes. is for hydroponics. This particular stuff is meant for rapid uh, root growth. And it just gets the plants going and motivated. And that's what it looks like now. With that being said, guys. Uh, wait, wait, hold on one second. Hold on one second. This is my little baby Hello. sister, Mariah. Hi. <laughs> Anyways, that concludes this video. Make sure you smash that thumbs button down. Hit that subscribe button. And as always, have a wonderful day. Do what you do. Say bye, baby. No, bye. <laughs> Peace.